Hello, welcome to FMOD in 2 minutes, the series for beginners in game audio implementation. Today we're talking about creating variation in your events. Here I've got my footstep event once more. And you can see down here that we only have four samples and I want to stretch these samples out to sound like there's more than four. Really maximize using fewer samples. So what we can do is down here where it says pitch, I can right click and I can add a random modulation. Add modulation and random. All of a sudden the pitch dial appears and I can turn this up and what it means is the more I turn it up, the bigger the range of pitch that can be selected um, each time the event is played. I'll show you an exaggerated example. I'll turn it all the way up and we'll play the event. As you can see, it doesn't sound very good. So we can turn this down to make it sound more subtle. Cool, that sounds good. Now, if we click on the event, we can also add this random modulation to other parameters. For example, like an EQ. I can go here, add random to each one of the dials. And again, I'm gonna turn them up more than I would normally, just for the purposes of the demonstration. So I'd normally turn these down way more, something a little subtler. And there you go, a really quick example. You can add this random modulation to pretty much any plugin that you want to add to your event and really quickly create some variation and make four samples sound like a lot more. That's it for this video. I hope this gives you some ideas on how to use in other scenarios and other situations. And I hope you'll join me for the next one.